Hello, everybody. Welcome to Lunch and Learn. So we're going to have something fun today. We're going to talk a lot about doing virtual events. Now, some of you love doing virtual. You can't wait to go live. Others of us, it's like, ah, don't ask me to go live. <laughs> so we're going to go over some tips. And the company just launched a thing called a mini party experience guide. It's 10 pages. It gives you a script. It tells you what to say, what to do. It makes it super simple. And I'll share that at the end. But in the meantime, I've asked a few of our Dynamite unit. We've got some in California and some on the East Coast sharing some things that they've done, maybe some things that worked or didn't work. So Monica, why don't you share a few things that you've done virtually um, that you've got engagement or had great results? Um, I've done virtually where I've actually contacted um, a few of my clients um, that I've been trying to get into doing Mary Kay parties and ask them if we could just book a party, what's it going to take? Um, and then when they absolutely keep saying no, I say, how about you just jump on one-on-one, -on -one, let me get this product um, on your face so you can see it. I will email you or send you the samples, not email you, but send you the samples and you can try them. We'll just do one-on-one. -on -one. And they said, oh, no reason to send me the samples. Just you show me how you do it. So I've been doing like little videos with them for five minutes, putting mud mask on my face, wiping it off, just telling them how much smoother your skin feels. Um, I've done the um, hydrating masks and showing them that that's what keeps your skin looking young and youthful. And they should really try the makeup because the foundation starts um, the basic starts at your foundation. So you need to really take good care of your skin and blah, blah, blah. And I usually, um, the last two that I've done in the last two days, I've sold over a hundred dollars worth of products. Okay. So you're saying that they don't, they resist booking a party due to time. They're busy, successful career woman. So you say, don't worry about booking a party. Let's just schedule up an appointment. You and me, maybe 15, 10 to 15 minutes and I'll run you through the product. And so you're doing it on your own skin or showing it to them. Yes, because I they're saying, oh, no, that's okay. Don't mail me the samples. Just show me. So I'll just show them on my own face. And I think the fact that you're vulnerable enough to put your own face out there to show them on yourself, then they start to believe you. And I've gotten two over $100 orders in the last two days doing that with friends. Okay, perfect. Now, are you, are, are you then giving them a closing sheet? Or are you running any kind of price specials or no? No, but I tell them that they want to book a party now. We can do this with everybody online and um, let's get a party together. And so they're trying to get their friends together now to book a party as well. But they have the product and they are using it. So they're also going to be somebody that has experience with the product when I do my party with them and they'll be vouching and everything I say. For everything. I will tell you, Mary Kay used to always say, if you want a party to hold, get a, get a happy customer to be your hostess. Because when they are a happy customer, I don't care if they've been on the skincare a week, when they start getting results and their face feels amazing, then that's, that's all you need. Because then she's like, oh my God, you guys, I can't wait for you to try this. And your hostess is excited. Yeah. And another thing I wanted to share too, is I tried Mary Kay probably 15 years ago. And I was not impressed. In fact, I even had breakouts, I thought, from the product. So I was a little hesitant at trying it at the beginning, but then I decided I wanted to do something where I could have my own time, make my own schedule, make some extra money, try to pay off some debt, do that kind of stuff. And since I've tried it, I love it. it the, the product has actually changed. And so that's what I kind of try to get out to my clients. Look, if you've tried it before, it, it doesn't even compare to what it is today. Within the last couple of years, scientists have improved this product so much, you have to try it. And then they go, okay. <laughs> and I think after they do try it, it does speak for itself. Okay. So are you, so in addition to these, which is brilliant booking on your end, and I appreciate that because I have two gals that keep saying to me, they actually got a packet, but then they got COVID and I'm, tr and I feel like I'm not pulling eye teeth, but it's like, I just want to book with them. And I just need to go to them and say, look, let's just, just do me and you 15 minutes, me and you. Uh, and I had that happen to me during COVID. It was probably a year and a half ago, but it was a, a woman who I met through the chamber. And she said, well, my daughter and I used to use exclusive Mary Kay. We haven't used it in years. And I mailed them samples and I couldn't get the two of them organized. So I finally said to the mom one night, it was like six o'clock. She answered her phone. And I said, well, what time are you getting ready? I said, you're going to bed tonight, right? And she goes, yeah. I said, well, what time do you typically wash your face? She goes, I don't know, 830. I said, great. Can we just do it on Zoom? She says, you want to wash my face with me on Zoom at 8.30? I said, yeah, grab your samples. So she literally jumped with the sample. She already had her pajamas on. She pulled her hair back. She did her face. I did my face. Her daughter was in the background. Her daughter's like 
late twenties, the mom and the daughter on a stack of Bible spent over $400 because they had used Mary Kay before, had used it in probably five or six years, loved everything. She got her daughter's skincare. She bought herself stuff. They bought sonic brushes. They bought everything. And I thought, man, if I hadn't persisted and asked her for that, just one-on-one, -on -one, if you're going to wash your face anyway, let's just do it together. It's 10 minutes. But thank you, Monica, for that reminder. That's brilliant. And then there's the satin skin. Um, it comes in a little round container. I can't hear you very well. The satin skin. It comes in a little round container with a gold top. It's a, a lotion you rub on yourself. Some lady told me it's the combination of that and the jiggly lotion together that makes an amazing difference. Oh my gosh. The anti-jiggle lotion she's referring to, if you're watching this recording, is a targeted action toning body lotion. We just call yeah. it anti-jiggle lotion because it's shorter <laughs> and it does great things. Okay. So Monica, one last quick question for you, and then I'll let Brenda share. Do you, are you doing anything live on your private page or are you doing most of your stuff on your regular page? I'm doing it. Um, I've been posting occasionally on my regular page. And then when I get people engaged, I switch them over to my VIP page. I want to try to get everybody on my VIP page, just so that's where I want to post things. That's where I want to put things. And I do a drawing once a month and I give away something very expensive, like a set of brushes or um, the hand cream or something that's, you know, significantly to internet. Anti jiggle price. lotion. Yeah. Yeah. They, so, they how do you win your prize? How do you win your money? By just watching a video that I put on there. And then posting your name underneath it that you watch the video. Okay. And they go into and a drawing. After, yeah. And once a month they do a, a drawing. And the person that wins gets so excited because it is an expensive gift. And it is something of value that they go all over the place saying, oh, my God, these contests are real. And they tell their friends to get on too. So. Oh, that's, a, that's a brilliant idea. I love that. Because, you know, sometimes we'll have one item of something that's maybe a higher end thing. And we want to, like promote it. So I think that's brilliant. That's super, super smart. Well, thank you for sharing that, Monica. Okay. So now I'm going to um, mute you for a second. And if you can't stay on Monica, feel free to jump off if you need to for timing. So Brenda, all the way from the Carolinas, do you want to share with us like a little bit of like when we went COVID two years ago, what did you start doing? What worked? What didn't? So when I am unmuted, yes. So when um, COVID hit, uh, I honestly had never ever gone um live i had never um i had done skype a little bit but that was only a one-on-one -on -one. i'd never done it in a group and so it was very intimidating at first and um but i was i was challenged to by my director to um to do some uh commercials and um so just a couple just a couple and we didn't even have to post them she just said i want you to do the and you know it was part of like a pace setters type thing so i did it and i'm not kidding the very first time that i recorded did anything it was 80 tries before i felt like okay that that passed i'm just saying 80 tries but i was recording myself and then you know the next time it was like 40 and the third time was like five and then you know you just okay that and so i got to the point where you know if like one time i i was sharing earlier i spray i squirted something and some of the cream literally went up my nose i didn't redo it was live i said well okay that's not supposed to do that you know you're not supposed to go that and you just you just, you know, go with it. You stop being um, so hard on yourself after you get a little more comfortable staring at a screen and talking. And um, like now I can see Diane's face, but I was doing initially Facebook Live where I had no interaction, couldn't see anything but my face. And I would try on the product they didn't always have samples. Um, I tried, I would try to get them to get some anyway. That's another thing, but no, not everybody had samples. And, um, you know, and it, it was tricky to get comments while you're going live to see and in, get interaction going. Um, so I actually do prefer Zoom, but I'm very, I do think Facebook Live coming on has its value. Um, 
So I would say if they're only willing to do a Facebook Live, then that's what you do. And it's just like the um, one-on-one, you know, we got to meet our customer first where they're most comfortable and get them, you know, introduced to the product. And then once they're introduced to the product, then now they see the value and then they're more willing to take that next step. Um, you know, not everybody's ready to just jump in and, and, and do something. So, um, anyway, but I would just encourage you, uh, especially like do it, do it. Like I started off. If you've never done anything, video yourself, get used to staring at your computer or your phone and just practice. And after a while, it's just like the, the phone calls, um, that you make, you, you know, you have a, a, a saying or a, I can't think of the word, but where you say the same thing when you leave a message after a while you do it without even thinking because you've said it so much it's the same thing with the videos once you do it you get used to it okay um and some of the things that brenda also shared with me earlier when she and i talked real quickly she was saying to me have fun be real she says you've got to be real like the one time i dropped something and I was talking about it and I dropped it. And when I went to go down to get it, I hit my desk. I hit my head on the desk and I come on and I've got this red goose egg. And to this day, my customers still say, that's our favorite video. And I'm like, really people like, so the more <laughs> real you are, the more they love that because it's, it is about being real. Um, and then you also told me being consistent. So do you want to touch on that really quick about why you feel? Oh yeah. Yeah. So definitely um, when you are regularly active, and, and specifically if they know, you know, oh, it's Tuesday, it's the day she always goes on and has her special or talks about product, the new product or whatever, they're going to be more apt to look for you, look for that, that post that you do. If you're all over the page, if you post, you know, any which day or not even every week, very first of all the algorithms with facebook you only get so many views you know that kind of thing and then um you know people just can miss it they don't expect they don't look for it as as uh diligent because they're not they're not sure you're even still around are you still doing mary gay you know <laughs> so. no and i think that's very true so here's what i will tell you guys is if up to the time you hear this if you're like oh my gosh, well, I've been posting like twice, then I disappear for three weeks, then I post it once, then I disappear for a month. It's like, okay, so we've all done that. Well, I shouldn't say I have done that. I think Brenda's done that. Monica's probably done that. So all I can tell you is don't beat yourself up for what you've done. Draw a line to say and to say, starting today, middle of August, I'm moving forward to today. And you can schedule posts. You can go onto Facebook and schedule posts. So maybe you have, so this is just a real quick idea. I'll just uh, mention this to you. And then Brenda, if there's anything else you want to share. So just put on a piece of paper, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Now you're probably not going to remember to log into Facebook every day. Cause I thought that's what you had to do. And I thought I'm not going to remember to do that, but I want at least one day of the week to be an engagement post. Like do you roll your towels or fold your towels? Do you prefer cats or dogs? Do you prefer to go food or dine in? Like anything that has nothing to do with Mary Kay, right? Do you prefer these high heels or these wedges? Like anything that's called an engagement post. So let's just say we pick Wednesday to be our engagement post day. Okay. And then one day you want it to be an actual video, uh, maybe a really, really short video from the company, from the video lounge. So let's say Thursday is your video day for Mary Kay. So video Mary Kay. Well, maybe Tuesday is the same product you're going to share on Thursday, you do on Tuesday. So let's just say Brenda talks about charcoal mask. She'll do charcoal mask on herself on Tuesday. And then on Thursday, show a video about charcoal mask. So it's layering the charcoal mask throughout the week. And then Monday might be just you doing a three to five minute infomercial. And then on Friday, you could just run some kind of a special. You could do, um, oh, Janice has a really cute name. Uh, I can't remember what it is. It just went right out of my head, but it's a uh, like freebie Friday where she'll do a thing where she'll say oh, only today um, buy a charcoal mask, get, get a gel mask at half price. And it'll only be if they comment on it that day. Well, you do a couple of those. They may not catch on to it till week three, but on week three, they're, they're on freebie Friday because they want to know what's the deal today. What's the deal of the day. And you could do a day. That's a deal of the day. So what's fun about this is if you get it in a rhythm, like every Monday is you welcoming and you pick the product. Tuesday's the company video. Wednesday's an engagement post. Do you like cats or dogs? Thursday's, you know what I'm saying? 
it makes it so easy. You guys, there are tons of videos in video lounge to do. So only one or two days are you actually having to go live or you can go live every day. That's just not my forte. Um, so yeah, so it just makes it really simple, right? Brenda, if you have kind of a set schedule and you can go in and, and you can post stuff. And especially like if Brenda had a client that says charcoal mask is my favorite, like I would run across a highway to get Mary Kay charcoal mask. She might say, you know what? What are you doing this afternoon? Could we shoot a one minute cameo of you talking about charcoal mask? You could record it on Zoom like we're doing and then you could pull it up on your VIP page, the little Zoom link. And it could be your customer doing a 60 second to, um, testimonial. She could even have charcoal mask on her face saying, this is the best stuff I've ever had. Like, if you aren't using this, you're crazy. Like, cause it's different when you have a testimonial coming in from a client that you make versus the Mary Kay professional video. So just another thought. Um, so Brenda, you mentioned about um, having fun, being real, practicing, being consistent, pick your favorite products. Oh, you mentioned something about having a special price for a limited offer. Is that something that you did before? Like you gave them a deadline? Yeah, I, um, there were be times when um, I would post about a product and I would say, you know, if you order one in the next um, 36 hours, you know, it's going to end six o'clock Wednesday evening, whatever today's Tuesday, you know, I would, I would do that. And, you know, and I would get, I would get texts, you know, people wanting it. Um, not always. Sometimes you think, well, that didn't go, but that's okay. You still are talk, you know, like, um, we shared earlier, sometimes a person needs to marinate about the product, think about it, you know, and, you know, they might not come back until next week or whatever. Um, now you don't get the deal, but you know, <laughs> but you know, they get on the product. So, um, so yeah, so, I, but you don't always have to do a deal. Sometimes it's just, um, just presenting it. You know, they, it's amazing how many people get a catalog and don't know what we set, what we, we offer. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's, that's called engagement. You got to get them to open it and to look at it and read it. So Brenda, thank you so exactly. much for your time. I so appreciate you. If you don't want to stay on, you don't have to, but I'm going to show really quick the company's new virtual um, outline book. So thank you so much for okay. everything. I appreciate it. So you guys, Mary Kay Corporate just came out with a thing called a mini party experience. And I'm going to go ahead and screen share and show you where this is because I think this is brilliant. So this is new on Mary Kay and Touch. And where you find this is you go under business tools and click on party central. And it's, you'll find this. And when you download it, it's 10 pages and it's a pop-up party guide. And I think what's really fun about this is often I can only speak for myself, but I would often get either tongue tied or if I was a little nervous, I might stumble over my words. And so this is talking about how to do a virtual party in under 30 minutes. My experience has been keep your pop-ups to 10 minutes or less. I know you might go what, but you can do that. So let's, let me show you some ideas. And this is available for you guys all to download. So the first thing talks about downloading a virtual background, especially if you've got a busy background. Um, but it explains you how to do a virtual background and here's how it works. Um, it's going to suggest that you choose a product you're going to use, share your camera, and then follow the dialogues below. So we're going to talk about this. This is a seven minute pre-party, like how to get it started, right? So they're, they're suggesting that you do a one minute intro and it even tells you what to say, you guys. Hi, everybody. Thank you for joining me today. My name is Diane. I'm so excited. I want to thank Suzanne for hosting the party. If you've got a party hostess, you may not have a party hostess. This may just be a live event that you're doing. Tell a one minute I story, share the opportunity, and then say, let's get started. Um, and what we will be doing. And so it gives you, and then here's at the end, thanking the guests, setting up time for follow up. Now, they're going to give you three sample parties as a template. And you can make, of course, tons of these. But one would be skincare. One would be on pampering. One would be on color. Now, another thought is I immediately thought of, well, why couldn't you do one on anti-aging? Because, you know, you could show microderm, the glycolic, the uh, radiance peel, and the clinical solutions. You could just focus on anything that is, and lifting. So you could just focus on all the anti-aging. So these are just some ideas of products. I will tell you, pick some of the products that you love. So you could even do one that was all about eyes. <clears throat> so it could have not just a product theme, but it could have a face, a theme for your face. So let's say you do a thing all about lips. Then you could do satin lips, age fighting lip primer, 
lip liner, lipstick, and all the different lipsticks and lip gloss. So you have five amazing products just for lips. You could do another one just for eyes. They could start with, you know, mascara and eye makeup remover and, you know, all of that stuff. Um, okay, so let's just take the skincare party as an example. If you said you wanted to do a skincare party, again, this is like a, this is a 10 minute pop-up or less, right? And so what you'll see on the skincare, it says, if you could wave a magic wand and change one thing about your skin, what would it be? Type it in the chat section. And so that would be fun to get engagement, right? Then they're going to say, talk about the miracle set for two minutes. You could literally read this and you could hold it up and then you could hold up the repair and let them know, of course, which one you're using gives you an outline. Then it jumps to the clear proof, the botanical and the naturally line. So this part of this whole presentation should take seven minutes. So if you go back and say, well, if that's seven minutes and I can do this in about five, that means you're at 12 minutes, which is perfect, right? So, but you're covering a lot of material. And if you seem excited and animated, great. Now let's say you're a lower energy person. I realize I'm like an off the chart, high energy person, but let's say you're a little bit of a lower energy person. You want to work on the tone of your voice, the energy of your voice. Instead of saying, you guys, I'm really excited you're here tonight. Let's go over the miracle set. Now I'm going to tell you all about Mary Kay's skincare for the next six minutes. People are going to go log out. <laughs> so whether you have, um, do 20 jumping jacks or jump up and get excited. I don't know, whatever you need to do to get your energy up. So this one does cover skincare. Let's go to the second one. This one is called pampering party. It says on the upper left here, conversation starter could be who here likes to pamper yourself. Um, so this is eyes, charcoal, microderm, satin hands, gel mask. I was actually surprised they didn't put satin lips in here, but they didn't. So but you could always demo that on, on yourself at the end. And then here's the third example is a color appointment which talks about our CC cream, talks about eye makeup remover, our ultimate mascara, and then the lipsticks and lip glosses. So on this kind of a party, you could even screen share our other mascaras because you can say, well, although our ultimate is one of our biggest sellers, if you want a volumizing one, we even have one of those. If you want one that separates and defines, we have Fanorama. We have one for everybody because they may or may not, they may or may not want this one, although this is one of our biggest sellers. And of course, eye makeup remover, everybody needs that. All right, so does this give you an idea? Then you've got lipsticks and lip glosses. And then of course they talk about trying color on virtually by using the Mirror Me app. So you guys, this whole program, like I said, is 10 pages, right? And oops, sorry, my little mouse just gets carried away when I scroll too fast. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so let me bring it back up here to the top. So it's called Pop-Up Party Guide. And where you're gonna find this is you're gonna find this on In Touch. <clears throat> So I hope you guys found that part helpful. We also have a lot of screen shares on our, um, our unit Facebook page and a lot of engagement posts. So I'm just gonna show you super fast where these are, <clears throat> okay? So when you go on, oh, sorry, I didn't screen share. This will be our, our closing thought. Um, and if you are not part of my Dynamite unit, talk to your director because I guarantee you she's probably got these on your unit page as well. But when you go on my, my unit page, you click on media, and you go down here and you click on albums <clears throat> and you're looking for Facebook fun posts and quotes. So this is stuff that's engagement. Like this one, I actually always get so much mileage out of like, show me, uh, which is the one that I, I, so I love all the quotes. I love all the inspirational quotes. Those are some of my favorite. This, I got a lot of mileage out of it. Would you rather have a maid, a nanny, a chef or a shopper? And somebody says, I want Alice like the Brady Bunch. She did all of that. And that, that I thought that was so funny. My customer said that. So I might pick a prize and say free mascara drawing on Friday for every customer that makes a comment below. I got a lot of mileage out of this one. You can only keep three coffee, jewelry, Netflix, jeans, dry shampoo. Like anyway, so those are what they call engagement posts. Like what's your favorite travel destination? Uh, I also love inspirational quotes. So I will do an inspirational quote every week as part of my six day post. Name a song that has a color in it. My customers went crazy with that. Um, and then these I use at parties, like last day for the party to end. But if you go down here again, how do you fold your towels? Do you have a favorite charity? These are all engagement posts that have nothing to do with Mary Kay. Tell me something good, wacky words. <clears throat> um, what kind of shark are you? And Suzanne Geddes, I have to say thank you to her in Florida. She does a great job posting a lot of stuff on here. If you were granted one food to be a calorie, to be calorie free the rest of your life, what food would you choose? <clears throat> Um, so just a lot of really fun, kind of silly things to post. 
How do you like your s'mores? All these things. These are all engagement posts. People have fun with this. They really, really do. So these are all things that you guys can share. And if you guys have some, please add to this because that's what makes it fun, right? Is everybody's posting on here. So that makes it, um, we can all share each other's stuff. So I hope you guys get something out of this. So here's my 40, my 48 hour challenge to you. <clears throat> In the next two days, I'm gonna ask you to go live twice. Now, those of you who are more comfortable with Zoom like I am, you have the ability to stream live from Zoom to your, v to your Facebook page. You can do that. So if you want to do it on Zoom because you just like this, for me, the screen shares are easy. Like I am so used to Zoom. <clears throat> it's not that I, I haven't done Facebook Lives. I have done them. I'm just a little bit more challenged with the screen shares and comments and all that stuff. So I like Zoom and then I'll just stream live to Facebook. That way I can also record it on Zoom and share the recordings and post the recordings later. So I just want to challenge you guys. So you have 48 hours. I'm going to ask you to post live twice in the next 48 hours. It could be for three minutes. <laughs> you could literally go on and say, hey, you guys, it's wacky. It's wacky Saturday. This is Diane. I want to tell you guys about these. These are boosters, not about a shot. These are boosters for your skin. Let me tell you, one is for wrinkles. One is for hydration. I need them both. <laughs> Let me show you how to use these. And you just do it or talk about it. And then you jump off. So I'm not talking about a, a whole presentation. I just want you to go live twice in the next 48 hours. When you do, I want you to text me. Okay, so you've got 48 hours from the time you listen to this to go live twice. And I want to hear how you did. All right, you guys, I hope you have an amazing day. Thanks for jumping on Lunch and Learn.